okay guys so hopefully you enjoy this or hopefully this comes out well but like i said today we're gonna be taking a look at the life straw that i made some mods to now i'm sure many of you guys out in the survival community have picked these things up they are really awesome regardless to what application you look at them with they are just a really great really handy thing uh, to have in a pack or a pouch i actually carry this on board the psk as i've shown in past it's a really nice uh, water filter but it is a little bit lacking when I first picked it up. Now, when you guys, if you have a light filter, you'll know that these things, they're just basically a plastic tube with two ends, your filter end here and your drinking end here. So they don't really have much to them, but I thought I could make this a lot better. So what I did was I cut off the two little plastic nubs uh, up here, as you guys probably can't tell anymore because they're gone but I cut those two things off and that allowed me to put on a big piece of rubber uh, this is actually bicycle inner tubing and what that allowed me to do was one I added this little lanyard that when attached to my PSK keeps this uh, water filter from falling off the PSK in any event so what it allows me to do is slip things like these little plastic bags under this inner tubing but that's not all if you do decide to put an inner tubing this long on your life straw you can put things such as ferro rods you can put paracord you can put all kinds of different little survival uh, pieces in little pieces of equipment for survival on your life straw and i think that that's really important this thing has, takes up quite a bit of space and it seems pretty useless until you throw something on it that can actually carry more gear. Now granted, I don't have a whole lot on this thing because it's attached to a survival kit, but the other reason I decided to put the inner tubing on there was not just so I could put more stuff on the, or attach stuff to the life straw, but it's also because it gives it more grip. This plastic, if you guys know, if you have one of these, you'll know what I mean, that this plastic, this blue plastic is really slippery and sli slippery surfaces or slippery materials and water don't exactly get along too well because that means that you're more prone to drop it or lose it or slip out of your hand. And what I like about bicycle inner tubing is because it's rubber, it's really grippy and it really has, adds a lot of texture and like I said, grip to the life straw. And like I said, I would highly encourage putting something like ferro rod or at least some plastic baggies uh, underneath this inner tubing because as I've noticed trying to use the life straw, it's great and all, but you really have to try to like get down to the water's level if you're just using this as a straw. So it can make, if you just have this straw, it can make getting water a little bit more challenging because you have to go down to the water's level. Whereas if you throw a couple plastic baggies in this inner tubing, all you have to do is fill up the plastic baggies. And one, this can be helpful because if right now I'm by the river, but if I leave the river and go inland more, I won't have any more water to directly access so I can have water for later and I can also have water at a more convenient level so I don't have to stoop down to the water I can grab some water with these baggies and then drink it with the life straw so I would highly encourage if nothing else put some plastic baggies with your life straw because that is a huge saver